Place, Michaela Alexander, ISQY Tomahawk, 425 points. Cole Peshek, Mike Slow, 474 points. Jacob Staub, Honest John, 717 points. Alright, 
with you with the, the cash prizes. Yeah. But there's something else I want to comment on about B Division. We didn't get the publicity out very well this year, but it's still continuing and it will continue next year. For B Division competitors who have never been to NARA before, there are available for next year, because there were for this year, although we have no applicants for it, um, uh, travel grants. I think, I believe they're about $800, and their availability and applications, I believe, are the connected to by the NAR webpage. So if you have anybody in your uh, various parts of the country who are interested and haven't been able to come, maybe due to lack of money in their B division, they should apply for one of these grants so that they can come to NARAM next year. The way that works is they'll submit their application and they'll either be allowed to come, or, and, and if they are, then they'll be issued a, a notice that they're coming and they'll be receive their check once they arrive at NARO. And um, I understand I'll give you a little talk as part of it and all that. So be aware of that. And if you run into any B Divisioners who have never been to NARO before and are interested in competing, those grants are available for next year. And now the further evil and start announcing uh, B Division winners. We have in fourth place the Launch Rod Solution by Michaela Alexander. That's fourth place. Third place. Oh yeah, and uh, fourth place is two hundred dollars. Third place, we're visiting the effectiveness of an airfoil by Zach Coffee. That's a four hundred dollar award. So come on up. Second place, delay variability of APCP mid power model rocket motors. And second place for Jacob Staub, six hundred dollars. And first place, high speed video analysis of model rocket motor staging. That's Emma Crystal, thousand dollars. Thank you, Emma.
First place, Pod Bay Norris. Three active stabilization systems from radio control rocket lighters. And move against the podium. This is I've announced. This is your Team Division R&D awards. <laughs>
efforts of all of you who edit newsletters because that's the way we learn to write articles for sport rocketry and that's where some of the articles for sport rocketry actually come from. So thank you all who do this job. It's not an easy job. I did it for five years and I've never won a newsletter. The runner-up this year is Narhans. and it's annex full of wonderful memorabilia that no one knows who hasn't won this award. Winner and still champion, Pittsburgh Space <laughs> Way, guys, look this way, right here. <laughs> you take the box too. <laughs> yes. Thanks, Ted. Great voice, these guys. Next is the uh, website award. And that was presented by Kim Gilmore. that support a website. It utilizes a scoring system that is both quantitative and subjective or opinion-based for judging. Winners earn the right to post the Website Excellence banner on their site. To be eligible for judging, the section's website must be listed on NAR.org, and all websites with an active link there were judged in the top ten selected. Of the top ten, places are awarded to the top four. In fourth place, Florida Space Modeling Association, FSA number 481. In third place, Southeast Alabama Rocketry Society, Sears number 572. In second place, Utah Rocket Club, UROC number 523. And in first place, Huntsville Area Rocketry Association, or HERA number 403. drops a connection. I'll have it back online in 60 seconds. Okay, um, tonight and all week, one of our usual faces is not here with us this year. On July 11th, John, oh, you want to Jonathan Dunbar, uh, who is fourth in C Division standings, had a kidney and a cancerous tumor removed. If you would please sign the card that Matt is passing around, the Get Well card, uh, is for Jonathan, and uh, we'd like you to sign that to uh, encourage him and give him hope to get, get well. Matt, thank you. Thank you. Next, we have the Best Midwest Qualified Flight. And that's always Chad Gray. I don't want to get the 
power bragging, but then it ejected just in the last second and smacked off of our Japanese friend's car. <laughs> That's a way to say hello in English. <laughs> Uh, Joseph Dorset had a payloader that almost impaled Lila. It was about six to eight inches from her. Nice, nice shooting there, especially trying to take Lila out. Um, Got to nominate the Saturn 1B Kato for today. There was plenty of pieces and parts living in the range after Barbara's model decided to come apart via the motor. Um, there was a couple other scale models that helped along today. Uh, Pop A doors, not once but twice, stuck it in the ground. Nice, nice shooting, guys. The first one almost hit Matt, the modeler, so um, I guess when you try and hit yourself, you're really going for the award. <laughs> your own model. And the other one was, you know, Mark McReynolds' doorknob. And the doorknob crashed not once, but twice. And the flight path up and down was pretty much exactly the same both times. I mean, he must have worked the practice on that before he landed it in the ground twice. So, those were the highlights. Um, if I missed anybody, I'm sorry. I know this is one of the more that everybody wants to win and get in on. Um, there, there were some other small crashes. There was a lot of stuff that came in near people because we were flying some lower power events. Um, I think probably the most popular name to hit was music this week. I, I don't know how many times a helicopter or a glider or some parachute landed between them or almost on both of them or on one of them. I mean, it seemed like at least one out of five times there was a music involved in one. So, so that was pretty impressive too. So out of all those, it was hard to come up because there was nobody really, really outstanding. And, you know, look through, and just on consistency and quality, it's hard to repeat a screw up twice and get it the same twice. So this year's award is going to Mark McReynolds for Flash the Door Make a chair out of it. Make a field chair out of it. I don't think the doorknob's going to Hey, Mark, I think you need to bring that back here. We need to crack a couple of eggs. <laughs> Tennessee, Carl McLaughorn of Wendell, North Carolina. I missed him. 
Leonard Feshkins of Cranberry Township, Pennsylvania. So, great to be Fourth place, 
Michaela Alexander with 5,520 points. Third place, Rachel Kaplow, 5,664 points. Jacob Starr, 6,112 points. Emma Crystal, 8,064 points. That way people can get behind me and go. Smile at B Division, Nara 55, main champions. Champions from there. We got uh, A Division, 
fourth place national champion, Ashley Van Milligan, 10,882 points.
section national championships. Fourth place with 33,614 points, SSS. Third place with 41,034 points, PSC. Fifty thousand six hundred and twenty-nine points, Massa. The national champion section with fifty-four thousand and forty-four points, Launch Crew.